the Oklahoma City Home and Garden Show is coming up. Right? Mm -hmm. And whether you're doing repairs, adding on to your home, maybe renovating a room, hiring the right contractor is one of the most important steps for that project, right? We're going to be doing it. Mm -hmm. Sean Rose is here at the Better Business Bureau of Central Oklahoma. Now, they're going to be out at the Home and Garden Show, and they're here right now to give some tips and advice to help find a trustworthy contractor for the next big project. Yep. Okay, so big tips uh, that we should be keeping in mind whenever we're going out maybe finding a contractor maybe going up to the home and garden show and talking mm -hmm. to some folks out there yeah so i mean obviously you know the great thing with uh with home and garden show is obviously a lot of the vendors are on their website and you can check them out ahead of time and then you can even like look them up on other sources like bbb.org google and we really recommend like in those moments you start looking through their customer reviews and truly kind of seeing what's the interaction experience like with this company mm -hmm. so you kind of have a good you know point of reference ahead of time okay and then go make contact with them um, make sure that if you're gonna get a quote you kind of like get multiple quotes uh, because you don't just want to do one quote um, especially if we always recommend three so it's from different contractors. different co companies contractors businesses stuff like that um, and make sure that you're paying attention because if one quote is like so much less you're gonna be like oh well that's the guy I'm going with but that might mean that they might be cutting some corners maybe using some materials they don't you know that we're about to go bad or something like that so right. you really really want to pay attention to those details there okay is there anything else like whenever we're going out and we want to get a quote but what mm -hmm. else should we be asking them mm -hmm. before they come to our home and start the work um, you know a lot of different questions really like you know are they bonded are they insured is some of this work going to be subcontracted out if the subcontracts are going to be sent out who's going to be coming to my house and doing this work um, you want to make sure that you like look up their license and insurance um, a lot of people don't do that well, how can you look that up so the construction industries board is great because you can look it up online right there um, you can go check the secretary of state's website their like legal filings are all in place and current because if not that could be a red flag for you about maybe if they don't you know pay attention to this kind of paperwork what are they going to miss on my house that's a good point mm -hmm. and how much upfront should you be paying you know um, when you sign this contract mm -hmm. usually don't you pay a little bit upfront? you could yeah sometimes people will um, and we recommend never pay more than a third um, because that's going to help cover their costs in terms of you know the parts and supplies that they might need for the job um, but making sure that everything's written down in writing on your contract all the questions you've asked have been addressed on your contract sure. and then making sure that that payment schedule is lined out really well on your contract because if they ask for it all up front that's a big red flag for us because you give them the money and then they could just show up six months later or right. a year later or never mm -hmm. um, so we only recommend paying up up one third tops okay and mm -hmm. real quick you guys are going to be at the home and garden show so if Absolutely. folks want to come up and talk to you what are some questions that you guys can answer for them um, we can help look up companies for them um, maybe if they had a bad experience with the company kind of talk through it with them and see what their their options are um, we'll have some great it's a like a flyer basically it's a letter paper size thing and there's three different columns that helps them compare three different companies mm -hmm. questions we recommend they ask the companies and then that way they can keep track of all that right there and help them make an informed decision. Perfect. So go check them out. They're going to be at the Bennett Event Center for mm -hmm. the Home and Garden Show. And for more details, you can also just call them up or you can also go to their website, oklahomacity.bbb.org. That phone number, 239-6081 with a 405 area code. We'll be right back.